Welcome, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm staying in the Hotel Af Valley Ortova in Tenerife. I probably butchered that name, but I'll put on the screen what it is because I'm awful at pronunciations and stuff. So I'm gonna give you a room tour of the hotel, well, my room, maybe the hotel as well. And yeah, let's get into it. So apparently I was upgraded rooms or something like that. They said this last night when I arrived, but this is the main bed, obviously. It is a shame that it is two singles put together because I'd, I'd love to sleep in the middle of them, but obviously they're two separate ones. Also, when I did arrive, it felt like the floor wasn't swept because there was hairs, like long hairs. Definitely can't be mine, but long hairs. And like that looks a bit dirty and stuff, but it is a four-star hotel, so I'm gonna just do a tour of the whole thing. To start with, I do have to say though, the ambient light around the bed is pretty cool, to be fair. Each side has like little book lights, or whatever they are, I don't know what they are. And obviously plugs, main light switches, everything like that. As you come around here, they do have a mini fridge. Obviously, you have to pay for whatever's inside. I have no idea how much it is, because there's no like cost sheet anywhere. But I don't know why there is a packet of crisps in there, to be honest. And I don't really want to open it in case it is censored. I'm assuming it's not. I don't want to risk it, to be honest. Risk it for a biscuit. So it does come with a kettle. Let's have a look. Oh, how do I look at it? Oh. Oh, pretty clean, to be fair. Not that I really drink hot drinks, but there's pretty good standards, to be fair. Oh, that's pretty cool. What the? It's all built in. Bloody hell. That's pretty cool. Oh, don't need that on, do we? They give you a couple cups. They are a bit dirty, to be fair. Or dirty and a bit chipped. Obviously two mugs or cappuccino mugs, wherever they are. Old fashioned tea, herbal tea, decaf tea, sugars, everything like that. Everything you would need. They do have a safe as well to put your stuff in. Free to use as well. Some places you do have to pay, which is a rip off, but luckily it's free. Then obviously wardrobe space. TV, little desk to do some work if you needed to. They do have like a washing service here, which is all costly out here. I don't know, I don't need to use it, so I'm not gonna bother reading it. As you come this side, they do have a little phone to phone reception, I assume. Also, a USB port, what the? That is pretty cool, I'm not gonna lie. Like, how many places do you know has one of them? Also, they've got an aircon unit, which is pretty cool. That's what you need, I needed that last night. Honestly, this bathroom is so nice. Look at it. I don't know if it's real marble or not, but it's pretty cool. There's me. Nice sink. Hairdryer. I don't know how to use it. Oh, oh bloody hell. <laughs> Some A Hotels towels. They're pretty nice. The main thing which I love is the rainfall shower. Honestly, I'd love one of these at home in my own place. When you're showering, you, like, you can kind of see outside, but they've got this glass you can move. Nice attention to detail with these um, like folded over toilet papers. Also, I do have to go back to this as well. Uh, there was a mark here. Obviously, I don't know what it is, but obviously they couldn't get it out. But it is a shame being a forced hotel that they didn't manage to get rid of it. But what can you do? Over here, somewhere to place your suitcase. A lovely big mirror, honestly, everywhere should have these mirrors because look, you just need them, don't you? A little chair to sit on. And I think this is what the upgrade has been for my room. The balcony is mahusive. When I saw the photos of the book in my room, like it was pretty small, just a couple of chairs out there, but look at the balcony. So there's two sun beds to if you don't want to go down the main area and two little chairs this is the view even though I'm not scared of heights I honestly can't look over the balcony honestly I just I can't do it I did have a stroll along the beach and stuff so I'll insert that now but I will potentially take you around the whole hotel because it is pretty posh, but I say posh, I don't think I've ever been, well, I've been in a couple of four hotels actually, but like it is actually pretty nice. It looks fancy. Like when I walked in, I was like, 
is this actually where I'm staying? Oh my days. <laughs> but yeah, this is just the main overview of all the room. Okay, I'll insert in screen how much I spent on this room. I'm staying for five days, four nights. Honestly, I did do the package through Love Holidays, but this is how much it is for the room. Is it worth it? Honestly, I was gobsmacked when I walked in. It was pretty cool. I only went for a B&B, &B, bed and breakfast. So I do have to pay for other meals if I want. I've got to go find somewhere to eat and stuff tonight. But, yeah, oh, oh gosh, honestly, my hair. Okay, well, I'm going to leave this video here. If you enjoyed it, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe down below, turn on the bell notifications, and I'll see you in the next one. See ya!